Hope you're all staying healthy and safe. Thank you all so very much for supporting my channel. If you haven't already subscribed, please consider subscribing to my channel today. I'll be discussing about another rich data type or linked data type called geography. So let's get started. Let me go ahead and type in country and then type in country names. Uh, let's do Australia, Canada, uh, China, India, United Kingdom, and let's do United States. So currently these are all text data type. So what I'd like to do is change these to uh, geography data type. So after I selected, it automatically gave me this option of um, converting cells to geography data type. You can either click on this or you can go under data. And then here you can see stocks. And geography so both of these are rich data type or linked data type so what I'll do is I'll go ahead and convert these to geography data type and you can see that now with this sign it uh, shows that these are already converted now what you can do is if you can see this over here this little box it says insert data extract data to a cell so if you click on this you have all these options over here uh, the data is that you can pull abbreviation land percent um, area birth rate capital major city uh, etc so what I'll do is let's go ahead and click on capital major city so if you notice that it was busy for a second it means it was trying to pull data from uh, the internet so now Australia, Canberra is the capital city, Canada, Ottawa, Beijing for China, New Delhi for India, London, Washington for United Kingdom and United States respectively. So I'll type in capital city over here. So if you are trying to find GDP for the uh, countries, uh, if you are trying to analyze data for GDP, uh, population if you want to increase your um, business over there what you can do is um, I'm gonna highlight these again and then click on this and I'll try to find GDP click on enter and here you can see the total gross domestic product uh, for all of these countries now labor market is also very important for a business to expand into a country so let's go ahead and do population try to find population over here uh, here is the population yes yeah, so here is the population so you can see that um, so the population um, is very important for a company to expand his business into because that is how you can find uh, your niche population where you can sell your product or a labor market uh, accordingly so uh, if you want to check for another data you can always go back there and see if um, uh, you have population and also let's do tax revenue that might be also important too um, so here is the tax revenue for each country tax revenue and let's go ahead and scroll try to find another data too tax revenue percent um, total tax rate let's go ahead and do tax rate tax rate if you want to move into that country uh, you might want to find out about the tax rate for the particular country so this is um, another data that you can pull from this geography data type let's keep on scrolling for other uh, data types how about gasoline price uh, gasoline price is pretty high currently so let's do gasoline price 
gasoline price. It is showing dollar point seven one. I think this is per liter. Uh, in the United States, it's done per gallon. So this is, I'm guessing, it's by per liter. Um, let's keep on scrolling. Let's try to find life expectancy. Life expectancy is are these. So I'll type in life expectancy and let's try to pull one more data point let's do labor force participation I'll click on this so labor force there you go these are all the data I'll pull in so now I'll uh, make it as a table so table uh, I always work with table it helps me to analyze data very easily um, for example I just want to put uh, countries like China and India with very high population rates so this is how I can just filter the data um, I want to do Canada and the United States these are the countries in northern North America uh, so this is how I can uh, pull data from geography data type as well as use table to analyze data hope this video helps you all if this video helps you please give it a thumbs up also if you haven't subscribed already subscribed to my channel please um, consider subscribing to my channel thank you all so very much Bye-bye. Have a good day.